And it came to pass after the plague that the Lord spake unto Moses and unto Eleazar, the son of Aaron the priest, saying, Take the sum of all the congregation of the children of Israel, from twenty years old and upward, throughout their father's house, all that are able to go to war in Israel. And Moses and Eleazar the priest spake with them in the plains of Moab, by Jordan near Jericho, saying, Take the sum of the people from twenty years old and upward, as the Lord commanded Moses and the children of Israel, which went forth out of the land of Egypt. Reuben, the eldest son of Israel, the children of Reuben, Hanak, of whom cometh the family of the Hanakites, of Palu, the family of the Paluites, of Hezron, the family of the Hezronites, of Car Carmi, the family of the Carmites. These are the families of the Reubenites, and they that were numbered of them were forty and three thousand and seven hundred and thirty. And the sons of Palu, Eliab, and the sons of Eliab, Nemuel, and Dathan, and Abiram. This is that Dathan and Abiram, which were famous in the congregation, who strove against Moses and against Aaron in the company of Korah, when they strove against the Lord. And the earth opened her mouth, and swallowed them up together with Korah, when, the co when that company died. What time the fire devoured two hundred and fifty men, and they became a sign. Notwithstanding the children of Korah died, notwithstanding the children of Korah died not. Thus the sons of Simeon, after their families, after their families, of Nemuel, the family of the Nemuelites, of Jamin, the family of the Jaminites, of Jachin, the family of the Jaconites, of Zerah, the family of the Zarites, of Shaul, the family of the Shaulites. These are the families of the Simeonites, twenty and two thousand and two hundred. The children of Gad after their families of Z the children of Gad after their families of Zephon, the family of the Zephonites, of Haggai, the family of the Haggites, of Shuni, the family of the Shunites, of Ozni, the family of the Oznites, of Ezri, of Arai, the family of the Arites, of Arad, the family of the Aradites, of Arali, the family of the Aralites. These are the families of the children of Gad, according to those that were numbered of them, 40,500. The sons of Judah were Ur and Onan, and Ur and Onan died in the land of Canaan. And the sons of Judah, after their families, were of Shelah, the family of the Shelanites, of Pharez, the family of the Pharezites, of Zerai, the family of the Zarites. And the sons of Pharez were of Hezron, that family of the he Hezronites, of Hamu, the family of the Hamalites. These are the families of Judah, according to those that were numbered of them, three score and sixteen thousand and five hundred. Of the sons of Issachar, after their families, of Tola, the family of the Tolites, of Pula, of Pua, the family of the Punites, of Jashim, the family of the Jashabites, of Shimron, the family of the Shimronites. These are the families of Issachar, according to those that were numbered of them, Three score and four thousand and three hundred. Of the sons of Zebulon, after their families, of Sarad, the family of the Sardites, of Elon, the family of the Elonites, of Jalil, the family of the Jalilites. These are the families of the Zebulonites. Zebulonites, according to those that were numbered of them, three score thousand and five hundred. The sons of Joseph, after their families, were Manasseh and Ephraim. Of the sons of Manasseh, of Machir, the family of the Machirites. And Machir begat Gilead. Of Gilead come the family of the Gileadites. These are the sons of Gilead. Of Jezer, the family of the Jezerites. Of Helek, the family of the Helekites. Of Azriel, the family of the Azraelites. And of Shechem, the family of the Shechemites. And of Shemida, the family of the Shemadai, Shemadaites. And of Hefer, the family of the Heferites. And Zelopha, Zelophehad. The son of Hefner had no sons but daughters, and the names of the daughters of Zelophehad were Mala and Noah, Hagla, Milka, and Tirzah. These are the families of Manasseh, and those that were numbered of them, fifty and two thousand and seven hundred. These are the sons of Ephraim after their families, of Shetula, the family of the Sh Shutalahites, of Becker, the family of the Bakrites, of Tahan, the family of the Tahanites, and these are the sons of Shud Shudala, Shutala, of Aran, the family of the Aaronites. These are the families of the sons of Ephraim, according to those that were numbered of them, thirty and two thousand and five hundred. 
These are the sons of Joseph after their families. The sons of Benjamin after their families. Of Bela, the family of the Belaites. Of Ashbel, the family of the Ashbelites. Of Ahiram, the family of the Ahiramites. Of Shufam, of Shu of Shufam, the family of the Shufamites. Of Huffam, the family of the Huffamites. And the sons of Bela were Ard and Naaman. And of Ard, the family of the Ardites. And of Naaman, the family of the Naamites. These are the sons of Benjamin after their families. And they that were numbered of them were forty and, th and five thousand and six hundred. These are the sons of Dan after their families. Of Shuam, the family of the Shuamites. These are the families of Dan after their families. And the families of the Shuamites, according to those that were numbered of them, were three score and four thousand and four hundred. Of the children of Asher after their families. Of Jimna, the family of the Jimnites. Of Jezui, the family of the Jesuites. Of Bariah, the family of the Berites. Of the sons of Bariah, of Heber, the family of the Heberites, of Malkiel, the family of the Malkielites, and the name of the daughter of Asher was Sarah. These are the families of the sons of Asher, according to those that were numbered of them, who were fifty and three thousand and four hundred. Of the sons of Naphtali, after their families, of Jaziel, the family of the Jazielites, of Guni, the family of the Gunites, of Jezer, the family of the Jezerites, of Shulam, the family of the Shulmites. These are the families of Naphtali according to these are the families of Naphtali according to their families, and they that were numbered of them were forty and five thousand and four hundred. These were the number of the children of Israel, six hundred thousand and a thousand seven hundred and thirty. And the Lord spake unto Moses, saying, Unto these the land shall be divided for an inheritance, according to the number of names. To many thou shalt give more inheritance, and to few thou shalt give the less inheritance. To every one shall his inheritance be given according to those that were numbered of him. Notwithstanding, the land shall be divided by lot. According to the names of the tribes of their fathers they shall inherit. According to the law, the lot shall the possession thereof be divided between many and few. And these are they that were numbered of the Levites and their families. Of Gershon, the family of the Gershonites. Of Kohath, the family of the Kohathites. Of Merari, the family of the Merarites. These are the families of the Levites, the family of the Libnites. The family of the Hebronites, the family of the Malites, the family of the Mushites, the family of the Korathite. And Koath begat Amram, and the name of Amram's wife was Jochebed, the daughter of Levi, whom her mother bare to Levi in Egypt. And she bare unto Amram Aaron and Moses, and Miriam their sister. And unto Aaron was born Nadab and Abihu, Eleazar and Ethamar. And Nadab and Abihu died when they offered strange fire before the Lord. And those that were numbered of them were twenty and three thousand, all males from a month old and upward. For they were not numbered among the children of Israel, because there was no inheritance given them among the children of Israel. These are they that were numbered by Moses and Eleazar the priest, who numbered the children of Israel in the plains of Moab by Jordan near Jericho. But among these there was not a man of them whom Moses and Aaron the priest numbered, when they numbered the children of Israel in the wilderness of Sinai. For the Lord had said to them, said of them, They shall surely die in the wilderness. And there was not left a man of them, save Caleb the son of Jephunneh, and Joshua the son of Nun.